Hello everyone, this is Emma Lupin, and uh, I know I haven't made videos in a long while. Sorry about that, but I'm posting this video up here just as a general announcement, both for upcoming content and just life updates, because a lot has happened. This is actually the third time I've done this video, well, the audio for this video. Technically fourth, because I had a draft before this today that I just decided to redo. Um, but yeah, uh, I haven't posted up anything for a while. I'm sorry about that. Uh, a while back, what was it, around August of last year, probably around then, I found myself getting back into fan fiction writing because I do that, or I did it I'm doing it again. I was doing it before I started playing around with videos and I know I'd kind of fallen out of fan fiction writing for a while and I'd started doing videos and I picked it back up again and I enjoy it a lot. So that's taking up a lot of my interest and um but it's also kind of led into some experimental videos that I'm going to be posting up. You see, um, when I was writing, I, I started off uh, rewriting a Naruto fanfic that I originally created in 2016. And while I was rewriting it in 2022, I ended up doing these kinds of essays slash discussions on Naruto world building. It started off as um, an analysis of the series timeline and it just kind of went from there and after a while I had this idea what if I made audio versions of what I wrote and huh I don't know it seemed like an interesting idea so I did a few experiments and I think I'm going to put those audio versions on the internet now, as for specifically where they're going to go, I am currently planning to put them on Daily Motion. For those of you that don't know, I do have a Daily Motion account. I created it to move some videos over there. My first videos um, after the whole YouTube Kappa thing from a few years ago, and I also put my Pokemon Omicron Let's Play videos on there because I of concerns I had with. YouTube and Japan and what happened with Swade's channel. Um, yeah, I mean, Japanese content, I was really just worried about it. You can see the video in the Omicron playlist for more on that, more specifics. I mean, nothing has really happened on that front in a while, but I'm still a little cautious about it. Maybe I don't need to be cautious about the Omicron videos. I thought about moving the Persona 5 Royal videos over to Daily Motion, but Atlas is probably safe. And, and with how quiet things have been on that front, it's probably okay, so I guess those can stay. Um, but yeah, I thought maybe Daily Motion would be better. I mean, it's not like I'm going to be using audio or music or clips or even still images on these things. Um, but. Well, safety was one reason why I'm putting on a daily motion. The other, I'll get to in a bit. But yeah, um, I think I'm going to put them up on daily motion first. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put link videos on YouTube. So I'm going to put a video on YouTube just with a link to the daily motion video in the description. You know, just so you guys know when it comes up and how you can find it. And the video will also serve as a place where people can leave feedback, leave comments, because, well, Daily Motion is not sophisticated enough of a platform to leave comments. And I want people to leave comments, and people should be able to leave comments because that's part of, you know, discussing these sorts of topics. It's essential. So that way people will still be able to comment on these things if you want. I mean, Maybe I might move these videos, I might post a copy of them to YouTube, but that would be way down the line if I was going to do that at all. So do not 
count on that. Absolutely do not count on that. Don't think, oh, I'll just wait for a while until they post it up on YouTube. No, no, don't do that. Because I don't know if or when I would do that or if I got into the habit of doing that, how long I would wait until I would post a copy on YouTube. You guys see what I'm saying? Anyway... As far as life updates, besides getting back into writing and just generally doing a lot of things at once, as is my usual unfortunate habit. Um, and this is the reason I wanted to redo this video again. Um, my mom passed away this month, so that was... It was very sudden and a pretty big shock, and so there's still a lot to go through on that front, and a lot of uncertainty um, about finding a new personal rhythm, because it is... I don't want to share too many personal details on the internet, because that's just generally not a good idea, but I took care of her for a very long time and that was one of the reasons why I never had a lot of potential recording time so that opens up a lot of time but I don't know how much of it I would have for potential recording you know around all the other things I'm gonna have to take care of in the short term and in the long term and just how much time there would be around writing because I want to do that I really want to do that um so yeah, and yeah, that happened. And one of the other reasons I want to try putting this Naruto content or any other potential content on Daily Motion is because I want to try and see if I can get that account monetized. And I know, I know, I know a lot of people have said, you know, monetization isn't gonna pay that much. I get that, okay? But it's still something. And I would like to make an attempt. I would like to experiment a little more, see if I can get closer to that point in time. I mean, the fact of the matter is that monetization on Daily Motion is a lot easier right now than it is on YouTube. All it requires is raw views on the channel as a whole. I think 10 thousand maybe maybe i know that it is just raw views on the whole channel so just to kick that off and that's just a lot a lot fewer hoops to jump through and so it seems like a good idea to at least try and experiment and see what i can do with that see if i can get that going and besides the fact that you know with all the problems that youtube has been uh, has has had um you know it doesn't really seem like a bad idea to me to give some other platform like daily motion a little more attention or, or just give it some attention as a potential backup well i'm not packing up everything on there that's true but Still, I'm going to be posting videos on there. I'm going to see how this goes. Because I really want to see how this goes. Okay? And some of the other experimental content that's going to be coming up is, um, is going to include some fanfic readings. Believe it or not. Because um, I also had an idea, like, on a whim to do some fanfic recordings of some relatively short stories that were easy for me to record at the time just as experiments you know i didn't post them or anything you would have seen that you know i just recorded them and some of the ones that are going to be coming up are stories that i've written myself which seemed a little weird to me at first to think about like really you did a reading of your own story is that is that egotistical is that weird to do that i I don't know. I don't know, but I did it anyway, just because, because they were 
some of them were shorter and because I could. Because I just wanted to play around and I think I will be posting them. Um, hmm. But I think those may go on YouTube first. I think. Hmm. That could change. I don't know. But yeah, <laughs> I'm going to be doing that. And maybe also some readings of fanfic that from various fandoms that are not my stories. Also, th that was one of the experiments that I did. So I may be doing that as well. And you can look forward to that. I mean, I think they still need to be edited together. And I do need to make the final decision on what platform I'm going to be putting them on first. But if they are going to, if they do end up going on Daily Motion first, you know, I'll do the same thing where I will post a link video on YouTube so that you can find it and know when it comes up. All right. Um, but yeah, that's what's going on right now. That's what I've been doing. And that's what you can expect. Um, also, there are, I do have several videos more of Sherlock Holmes Chapter 1 content. I kind of gave up on that game. It lost my interest. But I should get around to editing and posting that stuff at some point. At some point. I am such a disaster. <laughs> ah. um, there are also some Pokemon Omicron videos that I still didn't post a daily motion. And I realize now that I haven't touched that game in quite a while. <laughs> That's not good either. Although I did actually get a... I did actually get some ideas from uh, Linkara's Let's Play. He, he finished Omicron. Well, he finally posted his footage of it. And thanks to that, I have some better ideas on how to deal with the Miranda situation later in the game, which is a really, really good thing, because that was worrying me. It is worrying me. <laughs> um, and I know that I should try and do more of ep the Epic Battle Fantasy games at some point. I did want to do that. I should try doing that. Um, the most problematic one would be Epic Battle Fantasy 2 because does it not have save points like the first one? It might not. I don't remember. Well, it should be a little easier to block that out in terms of time, but still, it's a lot harder to do if I have to do it all in one run again. Um, and let's see, there was also some new bonus content on, um, Kingdom Rush Vengeance. I know I found it a while back and I started doing a little bit of recording for it and then I got interrupted. So, and then I didn't pick it up again for a while. So I'm going to be doing that at some point when I can remember to do that. <laughs> um, yeah. And if you guys are interested, I've I probably should get back to Hand of Fate 2. Probably. And I never actually did decide what to do about Persona 5 Royal. Because I want to play that game. I want to see the rest of it. Because I haven't even seen it in Let's Play form. <sighs> but, yeah. Like I said, that that's what's been going on. That's what's been happening with life. With what I've been doing. And that's the experimental content that's experimental content and upcoming content that you can probably expect to see on this channel. I don't know if I'm going to be getting into a regular schedule of uploading, but um, that's what I'm going to be doing, and that's what you can expect. Uh, so, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!